So now let's switch gears to some new information on the shooting, you know, south of here, uh, Saturday night at 88th and Southeast Holgate. Uh, that's when officers opened fire on a man that after he uh, failed to uh, stop during a traffic stop, then he led police on a brief chase, crashed his car, and then a standoff ensued. Uh, we're still getting more details in about that. We also talked to neighbors who say that Portland has a serious problem with growing crime. Safety first for the people and everybody. Amber Keats Hamara owns a gas station and convenience store just a few blocks away from the spot where police engaged in a standoff with a man barricaded in a car Saturday. Although he lost a little business due to police road closures, he says he wasn't bothered by that. He just wants the neighborhood to be a safer place. I just want the safety for everybody if they close more. I don't care if the, you know, is up and down for the business. The standoff started just before 8 p.m. Saturday when police say they tried to stop a driver in the area of Southeast 92nd Avenue and Southeast Schiller Street. But the man in the car sped away. After an intervention technique was used, police said he crashed at Southeast 88th and Holgate. At some point during the attempt to stop him, police say Sergeant Norman Staples, an 18-year veteran on the police force, and Officer Kenneth Jackson, a six-year veteran, opened fire. Sergeant Kevin Allen told us Saturday the man was injured during the shooting. After that, an hours-long standoff ensued and police asked residents to stay inside. After two hours of negotiations, the man was taken away by ambulance. Uh, last night we heard uh, gunfire, which is not uncommon for this area. We hear gunfire just about every night lately. Neighbors we talked to say aside from this police shooting, there is a lot of regular gunfire in this area in general. A police presence would be good. Uh, you know, I do. Um, but I think more than that, it's, it's the people that are packing these guns. You know, guns, carrying guns are, are glorified nowadays. I think it's getting vast, you know. Yeah, we need to make poor attention for the city city mayor or whatever the police chief they need to be you know more attention around this area and the suspect suspect in that east uh, southeast holgate case uh, is still in custody tonight he was taken to the hospital with injuries but we don't know the status of those injuries at this time and police have not released his identity and again back here on east burnside that shooting investigation is underway at this time and as we learn more details we'll bring them to you here in on coin.com reporting live in portland jennifer dowling coin six news yeah you can really hear the frustration in the voices of those uh, business owners and residents out in that area thank you so much for that reporting tonight Jennifer.